Rudy and Paco's opened just off the strand right here at this location more than 20 years ago. He says it's all due to hard work that got him this spot, a principle he's instilled in his children who are now living the American dream right next door. Francisco Paco Vargas is proud of what he's accomplished. 23 years, yeah. I am delighted and happy to that the restaurant take off. Rudy and Paco restaurant and bar is a staple on the island, offering South American cuisine, a delicacy enjoyed by many celebrities. Is there any celebrity that you were really excited to meet? Oh, I tell you what, uh, you can see where Tony Bennett, you see Tony Bennett right here? This was a dream Vargas had when he moved from Nicaragua more than 40 years ago. I started working in Houston, washing dishes, mopping floor. He traveled to Galveston to manage the Balinese Room, a restaurant only marked by the seawall with a sign after it was destroyed by Hurricane Ike. Before it was ruined, Vargas says the restaurant taught him how to open his own place. Uh, the American dream is, you know, when you work hard, it pays And that's what I did myself here. And, uh, the com and Galveston will open the door for me. An island that continues to open the door for Vargas's family. Across the street is a new restaurant, Vargas Cut and Catch, which is filled with different photos on the wall. This is Denise when it was a baby. This is Juan when it was a baby. And all three together here. Vargas's kids run this American cuisine restaurant, a place that got a boost thanks to a friend. When banks wouldn't offer a loan, a friend co-signed. Because of this, Vargas dedicated this room to him. Thank God, this, this, this guy, got, Mr. Peters, is a great man with a big heart. Thanks to his friend, Vargas's fairy tale American dream continues in Galveston. A success story, he says, isn't about fortune or fame, but finding a place that opens its doors for you. Work hard, dedicated, and work hard. That's what they need. Definitely good words to live by, and. Paco's success story isn't just a secret in Galveston. He's actually receiving national recognition. A couple of months ago, the National Restaurant Association gave him this award. It's the Faces of Diversity Award, something he's very proud of. You can find it right here in his restaurant next to all the celebrities that have come and eaten here.